All right, so we're gonna shoot and try a new method real quick of showing what's going on with routine grips. So I want to introduce our actors playing the role of the head and neck is our foam roller. Playing the role of the arm is my little focus pad. And playing the role of the hand is the glove, right? So the head's in here, and with an arm and guillotine, I've got the arm and I'm connecting like this. When I go to my power guillotine, because I'm getting deeper, I'm actually gonna come up and connect over and grab, and then connect under. And then when this hand shows up to defend, this hand grabs the hand. So I'm grabbing my shoulder, and everything's in this like crazy tight little package. So I hope that made sense, but we're gonna show how it works. So I'm here, I wrap super deep power guillotine, my elbow is getting in lined up with the chin. Boom. So you can see my hand, if you look from top down, my hand is showing up up here. I grab my own shoulder, and then this hand reaches underneath and is wide open, covering as much of my elbow as possible. The second this hand shows up underneath, I grab a hold of it, and now I just drop to the side. And Ryan can tell you, it's a super tight finish. A lot of my guys who have really good guillotine defense, this is what I'm having to do against them. So I get on my normal guillotine, arm in. Some people feel like this is too much space. I punch deep until I can grab my shoulder. My other hand finds the hand that's gonna show up defensively. Man, we're super tight right here. Boom. So in terms of naming conventions, I like calling this one the figure eight. I'm here. And I'm here, I've got this nice eight lined up figure eight guillotine. Check it out, holla.